So today, I'm going to show you how to get this game running in wonderful, glorious virtual reality. I've had this game for some time and I've really struggled getting it going, so I've not played it. I've not got as far as, uh, well, I've got as far as the menu screen and I've never been, been able to get into the game uh, until today. And we're going to have hands with this, which is brilliant. So download this game first and then let's just close this. We're on Steam VR, of course. We're on Steam. Uh, and then you need to download Vortex. I'll leave a link. Download, register with this. It's all free and it's brilliant. If you're doing any modding, you need Vortex. Double click on that. Let's get this open. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Uh, right, so download this. Do what it asks you to do. It, you'll have to update it and everything. Then just double click on games into the little search box here and I'm going to type in Subnautica well I'm going to type in sub and it'll come up there it is so what you do you just click on manage and all this shit will happen select yes and there it's and it's going to do this now as you see it's this isn't installed the uh, uh, Bepinex, Bepinex, I don't know. So it says get Bepinex. Uh, under this notification here. So we're going to get that. Click on that and it will take you to Nexus Mods. And see, Vortex. So just click on Vortex. This is how easy it makes it installing mods if you have this uh, Vortex mod thing. Am I pronouncing that right, Vortex? Yeah. Anyway, click on that. It will go to this. We don't want premium. Well, some of you might, but I don't. I like free stuff. Oh, shit. This is moving too fast. Uh, where are we? There. Slow download. So, we'll select slow download. Oh, there it is. There's a countdown. Uh, you've already done. I know I have, but we're going to continue anyway. You won't get that because you haven't already downloaded it. And it does this. I'm going to just click on that deploy. And I'm going to click on elevate. Oops, shit. Elevate. I don't know what that's about. But I'm going to do it anyway. And there, now you should have, it should say, one active mod. That's it. Minimize this window. Uh, what's all this about? We'll close that down. And we can... Oh. Now, the next thing you do is you go here this is a link i'm going to leave for you i'm also going to leave that you're going to copy and paste that this link click on that it's going to be in the description and there that's all you have to do this is the guy here just scroll down a little bit to assets first lot of assets that you come to not all the way down there there there, and double click on that and that should download this little mod for you there that so I'm going to use my mouse now because it's a lot easier for me let's put that down there so you need to extract this here extract here there these two files now if we go into our subnautica file here select it right click and as usual just scroll down to manage across and browse local files we can close this now and there they are our local files i'm going to just drag this over there to give us plenty of room that's lots of room there this is what we're interested in these two here and as you can see we've got that exactly the same and look subnautica data subnautica data so let's open this one up plugins and in under plugins we've got submersed vr so we'll go in here plugins toby and you've got toby there just drag this over and drop that underneath there now we'll close that and go back to this same here go back until we've got those two files and now we want to open this one 
and we've got two here so let's open this on this side subnautica data on that side we've got managed and streaming assets managed streaming assets so let's open managed oh two files open managed now i need a little bit of room here so i'm just going to drag that out a bit i'm going to slide this back there there so i'm going to drop it there so we want to select both these files and drag and drop them into there you know copy them over there they are down there so now we can close that and open streaming assets close this down open streaming assets and as you can see it's a folder there's three folders here i'm going to get this one i'm going to drag it over and i'm going to drop it down here because i don't want to drop it inside a folder drop it there so now we have four for four folders and that's it that's all you have to do with that now also in the description i'm going to leave this let me just uh select this i'm going to leave that so you can copy it copy that go back here subnautica down to properties and then look down here and as you can see use desktop game theater while steam vr is active you don't want that so we'll we'll uncheck that and we'll go down here and this won't be on there it'll it'll be it'll go ask when starting game we'll just click on launch subnautica in vr mode in steam vr mode sorry so you'll have that and then in here that what you've just copied paste it so that's what you'll have there okay that's everything let's close this down let's get me controllers oh shit what's that don't do that i don't want to do that okay controllers now let's click on play Ooh, and a load of shit will happen I think I've covered everything there. And look, controllers. Ooh. Look. Now, you can go into the options and you can mess about here. That's not what I'm showing you. I'm just showing you how to get it started. And it's beautiful. Look at that. So, let's play. Start new, yeah, start a new game. I'm, I'm going to go for creative. I don't suggest you do that. Go for survival or or freedom yeah that, that freedom sounds good to me but i'm going to go to creative just for demonstration purposes Ooh. no hands at the moment here we go Fabricator Ooh. draws from available data to provide environmental equipment using Let's get rid of that. available materials. For oh, your wow. safety, this so we've got smooth, cannot be over smooth turning. I think it, there are options the you can will select increase that. Your effective exploration range. For your safety, please pack supplies for long journeys and stay within five kilometers of the nearest life pod or habitat. Okay, I'll do that. So is designed to construct habitats capable of withstanding extreme she environmental it, oh. conditions. Weapons were removed from standard survival blueprints following well, the massacre no good. on a like weapons. Crime. So I'm going to press the on here. Remains the only exception. And look, that's how you climb. So you don't actually do any climb. I wish she'd shut up. Crash landed in wow. the acid swamps. Look at this place. Fought off arachnid kidney poachers. There's a fish the down there. Shut up. If he can do all that, you can survive one more day. Okay, have you finished now? Good. The Aurora suffered oh. orbital hull failure. Cause unknown. I'm going to see if there's a setting to turn that off. Detected. What's that over there? Look, my hands. Look, I've got hands. Isn't that brilliant? Should we go for a swim? Because this isn't... Uh, this, isn't a, this isn't a review and this isn't gameplay. This is just setting up the VR side of it. Wow. I don't have to do that. I'm, I'm pleased about that. 
Can I grab a fish? Oh, shit, I could have done then. Although, my feet. Let's swim around. Oh, look, big, horrible fish. Wow, what the... Oh, this is brilliant. So I'm not going to run out of oxygen or die or anything because I've got it in easy peasy mode. Wow. This is superb. Oh, shit, I'm stuck. Um, wow. So this is a must. If you've got a VR headset and a PC, well, uh, I nearly grabbed that then. Let's get closer to something so I can grab it. Ah, press A. Agent yes, I got it. Forms may have unexpected applications. Oh, right, so that's Eclipsum. I can strategy. persue- uh, persuend. I can pretend I'm swimming or loot stuff. Wow. There's big things out there, I know there is. There's monsters and all. Those look pretty monstrous, don't they? But they've, they've not been bothering me. Look, hello! What's this? So I can collect things. Hello. This is awesome. That looks dangerous. What's that? It's beautiful and all. This is just stunning. So that, my friends, is how you get Subnautica running in virtual reality with hands. Yeah. And if you haven't got this game, and you've got VR, get this game. This is, I'm, I'm not even playing the game at the moment. I've not tried to play the game. I'm just having a swim around it. Wow. Ooh. That is weird. And I haven't even had anything to smoke or drink or anything. Can you imagine this on acid? What? What's he doing? Oh, he looks like he's in, he's got, has he got some plastic stuff on him? Oh, Luke. Short oh. range scans suggest this biome supports extensive biodiversity and connects to a number of small cave networks. What does? All oh, right, there's some. What's that there? Oh, fuck. Is it just blown up? Oh, no. No, it hasn't. It's hiding underneath there. We're not going anywhere near that. Wow. I don't, I don't know how big this world is. I don't care. So, that's it. I'm going now. Because it's breakfast time. Breakfast time. Breakfast time. Wow. Oh, look. It was going to eat that then. Oh, shit. It's pretty scary down here. I'm going up there. And I'm going to go. Because I need some breakfast. What did that just do then? Did that just bite my leg off? It sounded like it just bit through my leg. It didn't do, of course. Otherwise, I'd be bleeding. I've got both my legs are there. Well, there's some, it's at something, look, it's there. Oh. And, fuck. Right, I'm gonna get out of here. So, that's how you do it. Wasn't that a piece of piss? Of course it was. It's always a piece of piss. There's my thing that I have, where I live. It's not where I live, it's my ex uh, escape pod. I'm finding it difficult to go straight up. Well, what was that? So there's big monsters. Wow. Wow. Oof. That is awesome. Yeah, I keep saying I'm going. 
I'm, I'm definitely going now. I'll definitely be coming back. What's over there? I want to know what that is over there. Can I go into that spaceship? Anyway, I'm not going to... No spoilers. Let's uh, stand up here. You can also get into the water by going through there, look. Through the exit escape pod. Anyway, going. Bye.